Many of today's high-end dashboards require fast boot time. This means the embedded flash memory needs to deliver fast data throughput. Here we see an example dashboard using our Spansion GLS flash. With the Spansion GLS, we have achieved an optimum data throughput. And now I will show you how this works. So, some months ago we were investigating on how to achieve a data throughput of 100 MB per second in an iMix 6 cluster platform. And we could prove that it's possible to bring the data throughput close to the optimum level when optimized settings are used. I would now like to demonstrate the real data throughput based on the expansion parallel north flash of the GLS family and the Freescale iMix 6 board. And this is how it works. This is a typical setting in the current systems. Most of the systems use a DMA transfer. The first improvement is if you go from DNA to memory copy and enable the cache. This brings already an improvement of almost factor 2 for the data throughput. The next improvement is if you reduce the number of wait state for the page accesses from 5 to 3. Now you come to a value of 65 megabyte per second, which is already very high data throughput. You can reduce the number of wait states further and go to the so-called lab settings. Now you achieve a data throughput of 80 megabyte per second, which is already very close to the theoretical data throughput. This shows you the excellent data throughput based on the GLS family and the iMix 6 microprocessor. For more information, you can also download our application note on spansion.com.